Mast cells are the first responders of your immune system. When an infection occurs, in under a second, these cells send stuff like histamine to other cells to say, hey, wake up, something's wrong here. In some people, these mast cells go haywire and overreact, like central dispatch calling in the SWAT team for a coffee spill at Starbucks. And this is called mast cell activation syndrome, or MCAS. This is a phenomenon that actually is a lot more common than anybody used to think. Dr. Lawrence Afrin, a leading expert on the disorder, has a theory that MCAS is linked to severe COVID-19 and those who had a wide range of symptoms after infection, known as long haulers. A lot of these inflammatory issues um, aligned pretty well with the sort of inflammatory issues we see in folks who have MCAS. Afrin says the best estimates show about 17% of the first world population has some form of MCAS. He noticed between 15 and 20% of COVID infections became severe, seemed to align. COVID long haulers can have symptoms ranging from neurological issues to extreme fatigue. MCAS can have similar symptoms caused by widespread inflammation. So he and a few colleagues published a hypothesis, a theory, linking MCAS to severe COVID. And things got more interesting as COVID long haulers came to see him. When we ran the testing on them, yes, we could show that they had MCAS and actually their history suggested they had had MCAS long before they got infected. When they gave COVID long haulers treatment for their mast cell syndrome, the COVID symptoms started to go away. Do you think you may have unlocked a, a huge secret? It's, it's an interesting hypothesis. A lot of things fit, but again, association does not equal causation. Well, Afrin says the theory, the theory rather, still needs clinical research. His hope is that his paper will help spur scientists to take a look at mast cells. Now